Circle Time friends, it's Kazi Zahersky, children's book author and illustrator, and I am here today to read an absolutely hilarious but also very important story. It is called Peter the Turtle Can't Poop. This book is all about eating healthily and being environmentally friendly. All right, shall we begin? Peter the Turtle Can't Poop by Kim Wilsh. Peter the Turtle went for a walk. He played in the water and climbed on a rock. He found some new food and decided to try it. Mm. Try it. But all it did was mess up his diet. The ropes on the shore looked like so much fun. Peter the turtle laughed and sang and danced in the sun. Just when he was getting in his groove, he found himself stuck and could no longer move. He laid in the sand and made quite a fuss until a nice starfish got off the bus. Hi, I'm Peter the turtle, and I'm feeling blue. I have tummy troubles, and I'm all tangled too. The starfish jumped and gave out a yelp. Oh, don't you worry, I'm Chase. I can help. Chase the starfish cut off the net. You're free, he said with a whoop. But Peter the turtle whispered, my tummy hurts and I can't poop. Oh no, my buddy, you poor little dude. Let's get you some healthy turtle food. After washing his fins to get rid of germs, he ate lettuce and carrots, apples and worms. Peter's eyes got big and his stomach too. He held his belly to start what he must do do. Peter the turtle grunted and groaned, he touched his toes, tooted, and moaned. He hid behind a log on the sandy shore with a mighty push. He pooped and pooped and pooped some more. I feel so much better, Peter the turtle said with a grin. Today I learned litter belongs in a bin. Now let's clean this place and throw the plastic away. Thank you, Chase, for saving the day. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed Peter the Turtle Can't Poop. I thought it was a hilarious story and also with a very important message. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, Circle Time friends.